Hi, friends. How are you? <sighs> it's been so long since I've had a chance to talk to you. So I just wanted to come on and say hi and maybe do some makeup with you guys and uh, maybe show you some new eyeshadows from the advent calendar. So that's what we're going to do today. So if you have a moment to hop on, do so and say hi. Tell me you're on. If you're catching me in replay, do hashtag replay. So I know you caught it. Hey, Linnea. Otherwise, we'll get started. Hope y'all are having a fantastic Thursday. Almost Friday, hallelujah. Hi, Denise. How are you? I did not clean my brushes. I honestly have not done makeup um, at all this week. This is my first day <laughs> wearing makeup, which if you know me at all, that is highly unusual. And I was like, you know what? I'm gonna put some jeans on today <laughs> and put some makeup on. I'm gonna look like a big kid today. <sighs> it's been a week. That's okay. We're, we're gonna... It's your Friday? Yay! That's amazing. We've got a long weekend ahead. So, all right. I've got my gorgeous black Saint Compact that I love. We're going to start out as normal, color correcting these. Ugh, I have something stuck in the corners of my eyes. Can't be makeup because I haven't worn that in forever. <laughs> you did the same thing today. <laughs> good, good. We're on the same page. We're in our big girl pants and putting some makeup on. And I'm like, I don't even have anywhere to go today, but I'm just doing it. I'm really trying to avoid going down to Nothing Bunt Cakes because I got their email and they're like, limited time chocolate chip peppermint bunt cakes, buntlets. I'm like, girl, you're speaking my language. I really want one of those now. And of course, um, the motorcycle riding club that I'm in just started a like exercise weight loss charity thing and I'm like I really should not go get one of those but I really do want to go get one of those <laughs> so I've been working out every day start since Monday and like you know watching what I eat making sure I drink all my water I got yelled at by my fitness pal yesterday because I hadn't drank enough or ate enough. <sighs> Maybe I do deserve one. I need more calories, right? But should pack plenty of them. I don't know. So what I have done so far is color correct my under eye with Mingo. And now I am going over my um, cheeks and forehead with a mixture of mango and a little bit of June. And then I'm going in my mask area with just mango because that's what it likes. My face is difficult if we have not had this conversation before. It is. Hi, Carla. How are you? So glad to see that you were out of quarantine successfully. How are you loving that advent calendar? I'm freaking obsessed with mine. I'm going to show off the colors today and do an eye look with some of them. I'm gonna put some ash contour 
no idea what my dog is doing on my nose. Went a little heavy with that. Oh, good. I'm so glad you love it. And then I'm going to go over that ash with um, June. Yeah, I don't know why. Facebook likes to, like, keep everybody on their toes and change everything. For like no reason other than just they want to <laughs> but it seems like and they're like oh we're not going to give you comments on your ipad anymore haha -ha, take that no idea <sighs> all right so i've got my kind of face one consistent color now I almost dropped it. So I'm using my, my sweater has a hood and it keeps pulling it backwards. <laughs> Drive me crazy. I'm using my beauty blender to just pick up any excess and all that good stuff. All right, so then I take the big end of my B squared I think they changed the names of all these brushes recently and I don't know what they are now. So I'm just gonna keep calling them what I know them to be called. I'm gonna take <laughs> the end of this B squared brush and I'm gonna put some bronzer on. This is Bella. This is our cream bronzer. And I'm basically just going around the outside edges of my face along my hairline and then working it towards the center of my face. Just to give that nice warm glow and give some dimension. You can work it down your neck a little bit to kind of help blend. And then I'm taking my microfiber cloth since I wasn't paying any attention and got it all over my hair. It's the bad thing about light colored hair. But see, it comes right off on your cloth. There we are. Now my hair is blonde again, or white, whatever color it is. Okay. And then we are going to, I like to blend between all my layers. That's just me. All right. Now we're going to contour. I'm going to take my, I don't know what this is called now, Best Blend Forever. That's what it used to be called. I'm going to dip into Indigo Contour. I'm going to start up here at the top of my um, cheekbone and go at a sharp angle down towards my mouth. I'm going to stay out of this eye socket. I'm going to blend up into my temple. Do the same thing over here. Hope everybody had a really good Thanksgiving. I can't believe we're already in December and almost to Christmas. I'm not nearly as far along on Christmas shopping as I normally am. And I'm only slightly stressed about that. <laughs>
Honestly, I don't think we're going to be doing as much gift exchanging like with my family as normal. My husband's mom just passed away um, Monday morning. So that side, I think we're just going to get together and be with each other on Christmas. I think that's just what that family needs right now. So, all right, time for some cheek colors. Let's see, what color shall I wear today? How about some nice, pretty pink color? Um, some that, a color that I actually don't talk about very often, and I think it kind of gets overlooked, but it is a very pretty color, and it's really good on pretty much any skin tone, is this one right here. It's called Cindy. So I'm gonna dip into that girl. And Cindy can be used year round. I'm just gonna pop it right here. And if you want to darken it up a bit, you can add plum to it. If you want to make it a little more red, you could add like saffron to it. That would be pretty. Or love spell. Love spell is a gloss. But we're just going to stick with a nice kind of pretty pink cheek today. There's Cindy. She's a pretty one. I'll have to go on and show you our reds. Our reds are freaking gorgeous. Okay. All right. What's next? I don't know. My brain's kind of everywhere. All right. So we're going to do our setting powder, which for me, my favorite, as you probably already know, is... Our, by Hourglass, it's the mineral, the Veil Mineral Translucent Setting Powder um, that you get at Sephora. I forgot to brighten. That's what I'm missing. Good gravy. I knew I was missing something. <laughs> okay. Let's brighten. Let's brighten. I'm almost out of white peach. They keep saying early December. I'm like, we're in early December. Can you bring white peach back now? <sighs> Oof, okay. So I've got my white peach and I'm gonna brighten right here and right here and right here. I'm gonna pop a little bit right under the contour right there. Actually, that's under the blur. Oh, yeah, kind of contour. Okay, and then I'm gonna mix it with my June to go. Under my eyes. And I know a lot of artists are saying don't do this area at all now. I've tried and tried to try to not do that and it makes it look gray to me, at least on me. Maybe that's just because I have discoloration under there. Oh, <laughs> aw, thank you. All right, and then I'm going to dip back into ash and run it along the edges of my nose. Contour that.
Y'all, I got new glasses for the first time in 12 years. I don't know if you saw that picture. And I'm like so torn because they're so cute. I really want to wear them. But then I'm like, but then you can't see my eye makeup as well. <laughs> Is that bad? <laughs> um, I really dig my eye makeup though. <laughs> oh gracious. Okay, there's our nose contour. And then I'm gonna take um Actually, I'm going to grab a smaller brush for this. I'm going to take there. I do remember what they're calling this one. They are calling this our smudge brush. This used to be called our blend and tap, but now they're calling this our smudge brush. And I'm going to dip it in indigo. And I'm going to come. Create a shadow under there to make that look bigger. Okay. Hi, Aunt Kathy. All right. Let's tap this brightening out before we blend it. I only put eye makeup on now since that's all you can see in the mask. Yeah. I thought about doing that and then I don't. <laughs> I don't know why. I'm that person when you take the mask off, there's like makeup on it. And I'm like, see, it's not for you. It's for me. <laughs> There have been several times that I go to Kroger and I'm like, I'm wearing a hat and a mask. They can literally only see my eyeballs. So I'm not that concerned about it <laughs> if I don't wear makeup at all. That should be the time that I only wear eye makeup. All right, there is our, there's our face. I love this sweater, but it does get annoying. Okay. All right, so there's something I've been wanting to try and, I mean, I don't know if, Right here is the best time to try it, but why not? Why not with my friends? So I'm outlining like the outer part of my lip with a light highlight. attempt to make it look more plump because I y'all I have like the tiniest lips ever and I don't want to look like you know I have a line of like coke around my lips or anything but 
If I can make it look more plump, I will do that. I will. So we'll see how that looks after I put lipstick on. It may be a train wreck, who knows? All right, let's get some brows on. So I'm using Arabian Nights, which is, a, which is a cream eyeshadow, and Trust, which is a powder, wrong end, and the Hotline Brush. Um, I still really need to get the brow wax. I hear it's amazing. And I still haven't ordered it. I'm waiting to close out a party because there's stuff I want to order but I really need white peach and it's still not in stock. So I'm just being stubborn and waiting to order anything until I can order that. So I'm just dipping into my Arabian Nights Cream Shadow and then into my Trust Powder Shadow and then taking short strokes to fill in my natural shape. Hi, Nicole. Okay. Oh, my eyeballs drying up. There's one. Here goes the one that never works out quite right. Huh, are you proud of me? I did not call it what I normally call it. Nicole. I know you're probably working, but I'm getting ready to show the advent calendar of eyeshadows. So I've started having to keep the living room curtain closed because my dog who has anxiety um, cannot control herself when the, <laughs> when the living room curtain's closed or open and she's like this huge massive okay um, she's this huge massive ball of anxiety when the living room curtain is open because you know something might move or a neighbor might walk in their own yard um, but when I do lives, I open it because I don't want it to seem like I live like a vampire in my own house. So if you hear her running back and forth, it's because she has to run from the front room where curtains are open to this room where curtains are open because she can't miss anything. Okay, there's brows. Yes, puppy feet, crazy puppy feet. She's crazy. Who knew a 
Pitt Beagle St. Bernard mix with dwarfism would also have anxiety. <laughs> mm. Okay, and that was in my eyeball um, finish. It's the my favorite setting spray. Okay, are you ladies ready for these? They're so gorgeous. Oh, do you see those? They're so pretty. Hi, Bunkin. Okay. So I'm gonna preface this by saying I got so excited. You do? What size? This is um, the bottom layer of a triple artist palette, which obviously there's plenty of room and I have my um, powder illuminators in there with them. Um, I got all excited and took these all out and then forgot what order they were in. So I am not going in day by day order. <laughs> um, okay. I have no idea how I'm going to do this. I don't really have uh, enough skin available to, like, swatch these. But, oh, and I dropped one. Um, I still have it in here. I need to fix it. But, okay. Okay, let me get this out. This is Nutcracker. Let me... So... This is Nutcracker, and it's gorge. Use my, it's all the way down there, <laughs> and it has stuff on it. Double decker, because you know I had to buy that, right? Uh, yeah. They, are, they actually came out with a new um, compact credit. You don't, so they changed it. <laughs> Instead of like just giving you whatever compact you fill up for free, um, you know my legs have tattoos on them too, goofy. Um, instead of giving you whatever compact you fill up for free, you actually, you can take that compact or you can pay like a little bit extra and upgrade. It's like a new thing and it starts today, actually. I think I need to find that graphic and like... Okay, this is the next one. This is Cider. I love it. I love it. This one is like, oh man, I love all these. This is freaking gorgeous. They're so creamy. It's ridiculous. That is pomegranate. This one right here. This next one is my absolute favorite. Like matte. It's my favorite matte. I've already worn this like three times. This is Noel. It's kind of a purpley mauve color. This one is going to be really hard to see on my skin <laughs> Just because it's like almost the color of my skin. Uh, let me get a wet. Try to clean my fingers off. Let's see. I don't know if you can see that up there. Yeah, you can kind of. That's chestnut. <laughs> I have mine um, by color family. So our OCDs run similar. Um, this is pecan pie. Right there, you see it's a lot warmer than chestnut. I seriously chose to do this on the smallest part of my entire body. This is figgy pudding. So pretty, I actually really like that color. I hadn't used that one yet. Okay, this one is Holly. Have a holly, jolly Christmas. Okay, oh, that's pretty too. Holy moly, that's Holly. So if you can see the difference, Holly. Okay, 
Okay. This one. Oh, I also have them like all mattes first and then shimmers. <laughs> mm. Yes, right now they are only available on the advent calendar. I think eventually they are going to possibly make at least some of them available otherwise. Okay, this one is Wasail. Wasail? Is it Wasail? Wasail? I don't know how you say that. It's, a, it's that, but you have to be able to read backwards. <laughs> yes, you do like to do that, don't you, Carla? Anyway, that's with sale or with however you say that. Okay. This one is Sleigh Ride. I like this one too. It's a really nice neutral brow. Right there. This one is evergreen. Eh, we're now clean places. Okay, here we go. Right there, which has a green hint to it, but it's not super green. So if you wanna try green, but you're not totally sure you can do green, that's a great green to start with. And you can play it up and make it look more green based on what you put it with. Okay, this is 34th Street. I want to be really careful showing it to you because it's the one that I dropped. So I'm going to put it back in right now and then I'll swatch it. Okay. This is really pretty as a base. Uh, right there, 34th Street. It's a really light pink. Okay, I'm going to switch to the other hand. All right, so now we start our shimmers. Those were all mattes. This one is eggnog. And our shimmers like are just mind blowing. Okay, so there's eggnog. Hi, Sean, how you feeling? This one is gold. Well, I hope that shows up because that's gorgeous. That's gold. There's eggnog and gold. I used gold the other day. It was stunning. This one is like one of my absolute favorites. This is sugar plum. This third one right here, it's kind of a pinky purpley. Gorgeous. This one, I think, this is tinsel. So this is like a silvery. Right there. I know eggnog is gorgeous. Can you see that? It's hard to catch the light on that one. Okay, let's see. This is Believe. I actually haven't used this one yet, but oh, dag on, it's gorgeous. Oh my word, look at that one, Believe. Wow, I'm gonna have to use that. Uh, let's see, this is Cranberry. right here that's cranberry so that one's believe that one's cranberry this next one is called eve as in the day before that third one is eve gorgeous this one is called Garland. Let's see if I can get it. It's like a really, really light green shimmer. Okay. Next one we 
we have, I actually really like this one too. This is called Snowbird. And it's like a coppery gold shimmer. So freaking gorgeous. And I, this, oh my gosh. This is freaking stunning. I love this one. Look at that. Um, I forgot the name of it. I was so excited. That one is frankincense. Oh, so good. Okay, this next one is Mary. Like M-E-R-R-Y. There's Mary. This is another one of my favorites. This is Myrrh. I did an eye look with myrrh and frankincense and snowbird. Oh my goodness, it was good. There's myrrh. And then last one. This one is called hot chocolate. Hot chocolate. Oh, hot chocolate. Whoop, there you are. Hot chocolate. Look at all of our freaking shimmers, guys. And then all of our mats. So these the advent calendar and i'm hoping praying and sending requests to our ask <laughs> that they will make these at least some of them if not all of them permanent to our collection because they really are stunning um and i'm, I'm hoping and praying they will hear our pleads because i know i'm not the only artist asking uh, so that's all hope that they will do that because these are amazing. So now we need to pick some of these colors to do an eye look for you real quick. Uh, let's see, which ones do I want to do? I need to put these back in. Come on, you can get in there. Does anybody have any they want me to use? I know Nicole likes eggnog. Oh, gracious, get in there. What are we thinking, gals? Evergreen? Okay. That guy right there? All right. So I'm gonna put on a base of chestnut. Chestnut is very similar to um, Stay Golden. If you have Stay Golden. So I like to use that as a base. Okay, and then I'm gonna grab evergreen. The green is difficult to see in it.
with chestnut. Is that the one I just put on? Oh, yes. Carla, have you been to um, Nothing But Cakes and gotten their chocolate chip peanut or chocolate chip peppermint one? Because I'm trying really hard to avoid it. And if you tell me it's gross, that'll make it a lot easier. Well, let me know how it is. Actually, just tell me it's gross. <laughs> yeah, I probably require getting dressed. Last time I checked, they do not deliver. You could probably talk like Ryan or Matt and be getting it for you. And delivering. Pretty sure that is now a part of my contact, like permanently. Ah, okay. All right, so I think what I wanna um, put with that, um, I think I wanna add a little bit of pink with that. Um, so I'm gonna try this nutcracker with it. Oh, uh, yeah. White mocha is delicious. Of course, I get my non-fat no whip, which makes it a little less fun, but you know. bit of this pink with it okay so that was nutcracker and then I'm going to put some eggnog over it And then I grab that evergreen and kind of brush it back in there. There. There we go. So that was, um, Chestnut, evergreen, eggnog, and nutcracker. Okay. Put a little eggnog up by the brow line.
There we go. How's that? So it's, it, I mean, I still don't think it's like screaming green, but. It's pretty. And I'm thinking if you wore like some green tones, you could pull it out even more. All right. Grab some of my favorite Thrive mascara. I always try to remember that tip you told me to do my lower lashes first. I don't always remember, but I ch oh, well. Oh, that's always good on the contact. I always swipe first up there <laughs> and then remember to go down here. This eye is in like a stage of regrowth, so they look really puny compared to my other eye. Oh well. All right. And when you mess up, just take a clean little guy and rub it on there. Once it's dry, it'll come right off. I'm such a weirdo about my lashes. I would literally be here all day playing with them. Okay. Uh, lippies. Let's see. I don't know. Did that white line do anything? Okay. So we'll do our indigo. I got to remember to bring it down a little bit since I did that white line. Maybe. Oh, I'm using the wrong color. Oh well.
what I look. Or what do you think? Does it look any more plump? I think I need to go back and retouch up that white part. All right, ladies. There we go. There's your everyday hack and your holiday advent colors. If you need stocking stuffer ideas, let me know. If you need a color match, let me know. You have until December 14th to order and still get your goodies in time for Christmas. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. Hope y'all have an amazing day, an amazing weekend, and I will see you all later. Love you. Bye.